Right here in Atlanta, the spread of HIV has been called an epidemic. And last night in his State of the Union address, President Donald Trump called on Congress to help end the spread of HIV, HIV by 2030. Trump wants health officials to focus on HIV hotspots around the country, including here in Atlanta. 11 Alive's Joe Hankey is digging into the president's plan and the impact it could have here in Georgia. Well, Ron, here is why the Atlanta area is on uh, President Trump's list. There's more than 3,000 counties in the U.S. 48 of those counties uh, account for 50% of the new HIV cases. One of the top counties is Fulton, also on the list, Cobb, Gwinnett, and DeKalb counties. Scientific breakthroughs have brought a once distant dream within reach. President Trump wants to eliminate the spread of HIV by 2030, and in his State of the Union address, he asked Congress to fund his plan to eliminate the HIV epidemic. The Centers for Disease Control's 2016 data shows HIV's impact on Georgia. Nearly 15 out of every 100,000 people are living with HIV nationally, and the number more than doubles when you zoom in on Georgia, where 32 out of every 100,000 people live with the virus, the highest of any state. The fourth highest rate for an area in the country is found in the area of Atlanta, Sandy Springs, and Roswell. You're going to grab one of those clipboards right there on the table and fill it out. Last year, we stopped by the Fulton County's prep clinic where doctors offer testing treatment and are also fighting to slow the increase of new HIV cases. A tool they often use is a drug called PrEP or pre-exposure prophylaxis. It's one pill once a day and it is 96% or better effective at uh, preventing people who are HIV negative from acquiring HIV. Even before Trump's speech, Fulton County doubled down on its existing HIV efforts. In January, the county approved $600,000 in additional HIV funding. And last week, the county also learned it will receive an increase of more than $1 million in federal funding this year to target HIV. It is a problem for Atlanta, it's a problem for Fulton County, and it's a problem for the state of Georgia. And today, County Chairman Rob Pitts introduced a resolution mirroring a United Nations standard of making sure 90% of people know their status, 90% of people with HIV are on treatment, and 90% on treatment have successfully controlled the virus. The resolution lines up with the president's plan to stop new HIV cases by 2030. The president's goal calls for increased federal funding to diagnose HIV cases as early as possible, provide quick and effective treatment, and he wants to protect people at risk of HIV with the PrEP drug. And President Trump also wants health officials to quickly find and respond to new HIV clusters around the country to prevent more cases. Coming up at 6, here why doctors here in Atlanta say the total number of HIV cases in Atlanta outpaces the rest of the country.